Today's morning minute, the purpose, the purpose of Christmas, the purpose of Christmas, redemption, remission, repurposing, reconciliation, and restoration are words which can be used for God's purpose to send Jesus to earth for his ultimate new construction, new creation plan, and destiny for mankind. This is the Christmas plan. Mankind's lost God's original plan A through the fall with Adam and Eve. This brought eternal death, sickness, and disease. This brought the satanic rule and reign as the prince of this world. Man is operating on plan B, which is not God's purpose for man. God sent his son to restore, redeem, repurpose, and reconcile all mankind. For those who receive him as their Lord back to the original plan A, the original plan is life, life abundantly in forever fellowship in right relationship with God. God's new creation plan is to restore and redeem that which was lost through the high treason of Adam at the fall. God made us, us, the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus so that we can enter, enter into his presence. We have restoration, reconciliation, redemption to the plan A, to plan A, the new creation, based upon what Jesus Christ did, not on anything we have done. And we read in Ephesians chapter 1, verses 7 to 10 in the Amplified, in him, in him, we have redemption, deliverance, and salvation through his blood, the remission, forgiveness of our offenses, shortcomings, and trespasses in accordance with with the riches, with the riches and the generosity of his gracious favor. This is now, this is now, redemption is now, which he lavished upon us in every kind of wisdom and understanding, practical insight and prudence. Wisdom is in the spirit, not reason and intellectual knowledge. This is why many don't understand and receive God's love at Christmas making known to us the mystery, the secret of his will, of his plan, of his purpose. And it is this, in accordance with his good pleasure, his merciful intention, which he had previously purposed and set forth in him. He planned for the ministry of the times and the climax of the ages to unify all things and head them up and consummate them in, in Christ, both things in heaven and things on earth. Because of the high trees of Adam, man operates through reason and intellectual understanding. Man misses the mysteries of God, which is spirit. The fallen, unredeemed man operates on the five senses, which cannot see, feel, taste, hear, and smell the spirit of God's redeeming love for all mankind. Life begins with Christmas. Life is Christmas. God's redemption plan is in Christmas. Amen and amen.